Hey everybody, I'm Big Mac Davis here, and welcome back to Scythe. My goodness, it's nice to be back doing these videos again. I gotta tell you that. Um, it's taken me a while to get back in the rhythm of things, especially when it comes to commentating while playing. Um, so, I apologize if my commentary isn't quite all there in the video, but regardless, we're back. It's going to take a couple episodes, I know, to get back in the rhythm of things, but we're here. No time better like the present. So, let's move on with the map. This is Scythe 100% walkthrough on the Ultra Violence difficulty um, played through Z Doom. This is map 17, the MS Futura, which, yes, I explain more in the video, it's an easy map, and I don't know why it's a map 17. But, Here's the video, nonetheless. Okay, folks. I'll be honest with you. If you can't beat this map, you have no business proceeding any further than this. Because beyond this map is going to be a series of maps that are filled with nothing but pain, death, torture, and devastation. This is the last of the easy maps. I've practiced some of the upcoming maps, and they are torturous to the bone. So if you can't beat this map, stay home. Let's go! Let's go to the left side over here and use these stairs to snipe off the four imps. Yeah, only four imps. How hard is that? Just watch out for the Mancubi fireballs over there. And then hide behind this box over here and use this box to snipe off the Hell Knight over there. And then you can snipe off the Mancubi in their box over here. Yeah, it's just that simple with the Mancubi. And look, a Spider Mastermind who isn't even that dangerous because you can just snipe him off here using this box as cover. And by the way, folks, if you can't strafe very well, I'd recommend you learn very fast, because beyond this map, strafing is going to be a key thing, especially for the later maps, I guarantee it. So learn right now. And she is now dead, so we'll grab the Soul Sphere in the alcove. Now, from where the Hell Knight was, that is a secret area with a Berserk Pack. Yes, a Berserk Pack. We'll use that shortly. Grab the shotgun ammo. Now, to get out of this room, you can just run up the crate here and get out. Now, the Imp platforms have doors. I just go through the left door. It's easier. Now, what you could do for this room is just let the enemies in fight, or you can take them out systematically. Or do what I do and just jump down and start a punchin'. Whoa, chain gunner in a nasty place. But yeah, I would recommend if you're a new player to just stand behind the door and just snipe the enemies off one by one. That's the easiest way to handle this area. Now beyond the bridge up there is a Baron, but we'll take care of him when we go up these stairs right here. Just fire at him. Grab the yellow key and then go back from where you came and go underneath the bridge. And we enter into a large red sky area. And we'll take care of the arachnotrons from here too. It's just that simple. And now about the mancubi. You could snipe them from back here or you could use these barrels to blow them up. But as you can see, doing that is more harder than it seems. So we'll just snipe them off from here. And that's it! Every enemy in this map is now dead. It's just that simple. From the Mancubi, there's the blue key. And then the Mega Armor. And then from where the Arachnotrons were, there's some Plasma Gun ammo. We could use a Soul Sphere, so let's grab one right here. Now there's the blue bars and there's the yellow bars. Now to lower those, just turn around, open up the blue door, press the switch, yellow door, press the switch, and they're now lowered. 
And there's the exit. It's just that simple, but we got to get one more secret. So let's go up the right ledge right here and fall down in the muddy water where we have the MS Futura in all of her glory. Right there is the ship. And then beyond the ship we have the loading crane, I guess is what you can call it. And on the crane we have the last secret of the map. So grab the stuff if you need it, like I don't. And it's just that simple. That's it. Go use the teleporter. And look, there's the exit. So let's go through it. If you stare long enough, you may see a face. Nah, just kidding. Let's just go. I, I don't know what to say about this map. I've commentated my way through it. I told you what to do in four minutes and ten seconds. I could have gone slower, but that would have been much, much more boring. Honestly, folks, I don't know why this map is here. I like it. I like this map, but just for the music and for the MS Futura. Other than that, it's way too easy. Like I said, beyond this map is filled with nothing but pain and jibitude. So be ready for that. <laughs> anyway, um... Yeah, not much else to say about this map. Uh, 25 enemies. Two soul spheres. Two mega armors. It's like getting two, um, two mega spheres in one map with 25 enemies. I got nothing. It's the last easy map. I'm grateful for that at least, I guess. Anyway, we'll move on to the next map, AD, map 19. So, until then... 185 enemies, or 181 enemies. I can't read. I'll see you then. I'm Big Mac Davis. Take care, everybody.